Hey guys, what's up? It's Nick. Sorry for no video yesterday. Um, was just busy with a couple of things, so I was unable to get a video up. Um, new cards came out. Uh, pretty good cards. Um, I redid my team, so you're not gonna see. You're gonna see one of these cards on there. Um, but uh, I kind of went to a theme team instead of uh, just the best possible team available because I was getting kind of bored of my team. Not, it was just like too good for my liking. Um, I, I don't know. It was just too. It was like easy mode. This Ricky Williams could come into play. Um, I'm starting to make like theme teams, like uh, Texas, all Texas team, all Michigan team. There isn't enough Michigan, and there really isn't enough Texas. So I might have to combine them and make a team, uh, like a Texas, Michigan, Oregon team type thing. Because I think I'd have enough players if I did that, and I might do that on my other account. I have the Michigan players. I have the majority. Um, so we got the Ricky Williams, uh, now we're going to have the Fred Gibson, which is actually a pretty good wide receiver. If I was still making my best team available, um, I'd probably replace Michael Irvin with him. Uh, he's got some, he's got all decent stats. He doesn't have any standout stats, but, um, I did play one game with him. I did buy him and play one game, and he was pretty good. Uh, I will give him that. Uh, here is probably the one I needed most when I was doing my best available. It is Peter Bolwell or Bolware uh, from Florida State. I could actually still use him, but uh, he's eighty-five thousand. Don't really want to spend that. Uh, he has not any amazing stats. Black shed's pretty high. Um, tackling should be that high. I uh, can't tell you his depth chart stats. And here's the final one, the one that uh, I was the most excited about, uh, right here, Sean Taylor. Currently sitting at two hundred and ninety thousand. Not amazing stats on the back of this card, um, but he does have some pretty good depth chart stats. Uh, so let's go take a look at my team. Uh, it is a all Miami team with uh, Florida filled in teams from Florida filling in the um, the spots where there isn't a, there wasn't a player from Miami. So on my offensive line, uh, I've got. Jason Fox, Eric Winston, uh, I had to play him at left guard because it really wasn't another place, and then Orlando Franklin as my right tackle. Uh, they only had, Miami only had three, uh, three linemen in the game that I can find on the auction. They might have more, but that's all I can find on the auction. So I had to fill in the rest of the offensive line with Marquise and Mike Pouncey, um, kind of make my line better than it should be, like, but they, they help it out, and I need that little help. Uh, fullback, uh, Miami didn't have one, so I'm using the William Floyd. Uh, halfback is Edger and James. I'll actually go to my actors when I'm done with this and show you. Pass offense, I got Michael Irvin, Santana Moss, Andre Johnson, uh, and Kella Winslow Sr. I'm playing Vic. If uh, if I'm really going for the hardcore, I want my theme. Um, I'll play Charlie Ward here. But what I was running is, where is he? Devin Hester as my quarterback and running the read option. The Hester's got 98 speed, and I think it's like 97 acceleration. Uh, so I was running the read option with him, but I actually wanted to throw the ball for one, so I put Vic in. Uh, the defense, uh, they don't have very good left and right ends, but they have Oliver Vernon and Alan Bailey. Uh, the D tackles are where they shine. They got Warren Sapp and Vince Woolfork. Uh, linebackers, they didn't have a left outside linebacker, so Jonathan Vilma is playing my left outside linebacker. Got Ray Lewis in the middle. Uh, Colin McCarthy is the second middle linebacker, and then Sean Spence is my right outside linebacker. Uh, secondary, um, they don't have very good corners. Uh, they got Brandon Harris, uh, Demarcus Van Dyke, who has 97 speed, uh, so he can keep up with like Randy Moss and whatnot. Uh, Sam Shields, and then playing my fourth corner, we've got Bruce Johnson. Uh, my safeties, they have great safeties. Uh, decided to play Sean Taylor as the strong safety and play Ed Reed as the free because if you take Ed Reed and you try to play him, hold on, I got too many cards, let's see here, do this. If you play Ed Reed, he's a 90 free, which that's four lower than what he is at strong, or at, that is at, for, at strong safety, he's a 90, and at free, he's a 94. And then Sean Taylor's a 96 at free and a 95 at strong, so I uh, thought that would work better. Sean Taylor, pretty much a boss. I'll show you his depth chart stats since I have him. Uh, strong safety. Um, 
He's got 94 acceleration, which is great. Uh, able to um, catch up to most wide receivers, even though he doesn't have the fastest speed. He's got 81 catching, uh, 93 jumping, 91 tackle. That's on the back. 97 hit power. That's huge. I've caused, I think, two fumbles with him already. Uh, 92 play rec. That's great, too. Uh, I think that's all the big ones. He's got like 91 stamina and 93 injury, but that's not huge. Uh, okay, that reset this. Hold on, this is gonna be really quickly done. Do my intro roll. Okay. Um, for kicker and uh, reset it. Let's see here. Kicker Graham Gano, because Miami didn't have a kicker I could find in, so he's from Florida State. Uh, Matt Bosher, uh, Devin Hester returning my kicks. Pouncey is the long snapper. Team items, I got Miami Stadium, uh, Miami home and away. I want to do the, uh, to get the pro combat unis. I'll show you in the collections. If you go here to the mascot ones, it's right there. The Nike pro combat alternate homes. Uh, but I don't have any of them. I already put most of my crap into these, so I'd have to go buy it. I'd have to go buy the crap to put in there. It probably cost me like 20000 or something like that. Uh, which I'm not willing uh, to spend on a jersey. I still do have all my uh, legendary cards, all my Heisman winners, right here. I don't know what to do with them. They're just gonna sit in here. They're just gonna chill in here for now because I don't. They can't be on the team with the way I have it themed right now. So I just have no choice but to leave them in there. And then probably when I go back to making my best team available. Uh, which won't, because I'm going to play with this team for a while, but eventually there's not going to be any more Miami players for them to make. So I'm going to have to go to a different team or I'm going to be stuck with this team forever. Uh, so yeah, I might I might um, take some of the Florida players uh, that are better at positions like, um, I, I don't even know, like a left outside linebacker, I could play that uh, bullware. And uh, so just let me know if you guys think I should keep my team um, as much Miami as possible, or if I should um, incorporate more different Florida players from Florida State, um, Florida, Florida International, Florida Atlantic, Flor South Florida, Central Florida, all that crap. Uh, just tell me. Uh, in my quarterbacks, I just have Charlie Warden, Michael Vick, halfbacks, Edron James, Willis McGahee, Frank Gore, and Michael James, uh, fullback William Floyd. Wide receivers, Michael Irvin, Santana Moss, Andre Johnson, Devin Hester, Roscoe Parrish, and Reggie Wayne. Tight ends, Kellen Winslow Sr., Greg Olson, and Jimmy Graham. Left tackle, Jason Fox. Left guard, there was seriously, I was looking for a, any player from Florida. From all the Florida schools that are in this game, there was not a left guard on the auction. So I have John Malecki from Pittsburgh. Center, Pouncey, Pouncey. Uh, right tackle Winston and or and Orlando Franklin, Oliver Vernon, Alan Bailey, uh, Michael Regis, uh, Vincent Warren. Up to outside linebacker, I got Tyron Tyrone McKenzie because there wasn't a player from uh, Miami, so I had to find a Florida player to go up my left outside. Uh, middle linebacker Ray Lewis, Jonathan Vilma, and Colin McCarthy. Right outside uh, Sean Spence and John Beeson. Corners. They really only have four corners that go that went to the EU, so I didn't really have a choice there. Uh, free safety: Sean Taylor, Ed Reed, Antrell Roll, and Brandon Merriweather. Strong safety: I still have Michael Huff because Michael Huff is one of my favorite players, uh, so I'm going to keep him there, uh, just on my team. Uh, Graham Gano and uh, Matt Bosher. So, yeah, they also release new collections, new weeklies. Uh, I think I already told you about the bronze. But they also release some silvers. I don't. Uh, if I pull the cards, I throw them in. I probably have a bunch more in my reserves. I need to uh, throw in, but the reward is not that high to warrant me like taking an extreme amount of time, which it wouldn't really take me that long. But to take the time to put them in, because they really don't. You get crap from them. You get. I can discard the the pack for like. 500 coins, maybe, if I'm lucky. I don't even remember. I think it may be 400 is what I got for my last one. Uh, so it's not really worth it. Uh, right now, I what I'm doing is I'm trying to play through all the solo challenges, which is going to take me quite a lot of time because I haven't played through much of them. Uh, but I want to play through all of them, so then I can just focus on uh, playing the head-to-head -head seasons and going up that. 
and then whenever new solo challenges come out, I can just play the solo challenges. Uh, so that's going to do it for this video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and let me know about what you think of my team and any changes you think I should make, or if I'm missing any Miami players' at positions, or just, well, I know I'm missing some in my active cards. I do have some in my reserves, but just let me know. I will catch you all later, and peace out, guys.